Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm Nick Gray from Fandroid, and we are at the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 launch event today in Brooklyn. And we are testing out the camera on the new phone. This is a look at the front facing camera. We're going to be going around taking some shots and some videos using the front and rear facing cameras on this device to give you an idea of what this device can actually do. So let's take a look. As far as cameras and lenses go, on the back this has two 12 megapixel cameras which include the main and 2x telephoto. And then there's a 16 megapixel wide angle lens which we're using to record video right now. But if we go around and we can see what going from wide angle to the standard and then to the 2x zoom to give you an idea of how close we can get into the subject and then zooming back out again. And you can do this with photos as well, being able to get in close to your subject or zooming out to get a wider view of the area. Well, there are a handful of devices out there with an ultra wide standard and telephoto zoom lens in there. Not that many actually allow you to record video with all three lenses. Being able to have an ultra wide view here gives you a good look at the room, standard, and then zoom in over here all the way up to that Galaxy logo right there. It really shows you the amount of capabilities that you have on here that you typically don't get with most other devices. One of the new video features that this camera has is actually the live focus capabilities for the front facing camera and the rear facing cameras as well. So you see right now there's a digital blur on everything in the background behind me. Uh, it looks to work pretty well. Uh, we've spotted a couple different times where it doesn't keep focus a lot and kind of highlight some of the items in the background, but it's something that most other devices currently don't have.
and that's going to do it for our quick look at the camera quality on the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus. These two phones do feature the same three main sensors on the back of the phone with the standard telephoto and ultra wide lens and then a 10 megapixel front facing camera that's inside the display. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to Fandroid and we hope to catch you in the next one.